Hey guys, welcome back. So tomorrow is Grayson's fourth birthday and I am so freaking excited. And like many people that are experiencing quarantine birthdays, it's been a bit of a challenge to make it special and authentic to my child personally, but I'm sure to everybody out there, um, you know, Grayson's fourth birthday was supposed to be spent at Disney, um, but it's okay. He'll have his moment in Disney. And I decided, and everybody knows this about me, I hate baking. I'm not good at it at all. I mean, I like it, it just, I'm like the epitome of Pinterest fails, but I'm gonna give it my best shot. I'm going to attempt to make a Hulk smash cake. So I basically got everything on Amazon and I got Grayson special gluten-free vanilla cake. I'm gonna make double the batch because I need this oversized pan, um, which I don't even know if I'm doing it right because this calls for like an eight inch round pan and this is like 11 by 15. But it's because I ordered this on Amazon and I'm being quiet because He's upstairs, and if he hears that I'm making him a cake, he'll come down. So it's happy fourth birthday, Grayson. Uh, apparently somebody on Amazon makes um, custom made fondant sheets. Uh, super adorable, came super fast. So perfect, like literally so perfect. And I still wanted to give room, because I didn't know what was showing up on time, like literally, Everything on Amazon, it's like backed up. You can't get anything at the store, it's wild. So I'm just trying to like figure it out. And happy birthday, little like stick it sign. I figured I'd put in the corner. Then I got this like Hulk smash. And apparently this smashes. I don't know what the hell I'm doing with this. Um, and then I got the Avengers candles, four of them. So I needed like space, I needed a room. But that's perfect for I think like an eight by or nine by thirteen. Um, but I need like the. I'm so scared. I'm so scared that he's gonna hear me. But I have to bake the cake early. I'm so tired right now. I got four hours of sleep last night because I wanted to make sure that I could get everything ready for him and the cake. So I got to bed at one and then I got up at five. Welcome to Mama. Okay, so I am going to actually attempt food coloring to make the vanilla cake baby cream. I don't even know if I have it. So please hold while I check. Okay, I do. So let's get this party started. Okay, so I have to double everything. So it's, I don't even know if that's like a thing. We're gonna have to make it a thing. Okay. So we're gonna just, oh my God. How's your Monday going? Six and a half hours later. Dust. Set dust in. Oh my god. Rain. Okay. Set aside. You know what? It's to the side. If I make any more freaking noise, I'll use this one. One plus for three, so I need six eggs. It's not like I can go to the store and get more. Cool. And six. Milani is gonna help me put all this together. She didn't want to participate in baking because she said we just gotta set it aside, Mom, and I'll be bored. 
two thirds cup of water, two tablespoons of vanilla extract, and now two thirds of oil. I should just tell them that I'm doing homework or something. I'm sure they'll have nothing to do with down here. Definitely looking hulky and gross. Pour it in there. Ew. Looks like greens. Wow. I'm looking a little bit into my teeth and I got my kids doing that all the time. And they probably got it from me. But that looks like a green look. Fantastic, right? Maybe blue will help out. Blue. Still don't know what I'm gonna do with the frosting. 30 to 35 minutes for one. I don't know if that's the case for two. We always wanna start at the base, I've learned, because you can always add time when it comes to baking. You can't, like, take it away. You know, once it's burnt, it's burnt or overcooked, so it's a very Hulk-like color. If there's anything in this world that I want to finally be a success when it comes to me and baking, it's Grayson's with baking. So I will let you know how long actually double the recipe takes to cook, but I'm gonna hide everything, cool it, and then come back with Lonnie and try and decorate it before I eat it all. All right, so Lonnie passed out on me. She was in the pool with me for the last four and a half hours. Um, I think I also popped my eardrum, but that's besides the point. So, yeah. The cake took only 35 minutes at 350, which was the standard time for one cake. But as you can see, something I knew that was gonna happen, like I said in the other video, is the dark almond flour didn't really allow for the green to come out. To be expected, um, I'll be honest though, like look, I can't even talk. I'm really nervous that, <sighs> I'm gonna screw this up. Got one shot. One thing I did make sure, which I know happens a lot, is, uh, I'm gonna screw up my ear. The cake is cold. I let it sit in the fridge for four or five hours. I feel like if anything's gonna go wrong, which so many other things can still go wrong, this would be it. <sighs> this is so much pressure. I just screw it up. Cool, it's not even coming out. Remember when I said so many things could go wrong? Wow. Well, this could be one. Who flips a cake like that? It is not budging. <clears throat> Zach just texted me that an article on TMZ saying the deadly hornets that apparently are taking over the United States took out a mouse because, you know, Coronavirus, quarantine, school closings, the economy taking a dump. I don't know. 
God knows what else. But let's just throw in the mix. Deadly hornets. Oh my God, oh my God, I don't even have to pull the I can work with this. Super soft. And then just blue. So it's like a nice blue green swirl. Like we're getting there. Maybe we want it a little bit darker. O-M-G, um, You know, I see pros, but there's a beating it on. And they got these fancy metal spatulas. <sighs> Just got to get. So, you know, I'm not about that beating the icing on. Just strictly because she makes me nervous as hell. And it's like pulling. But do not take any advice on me. Like I don't make these videos for you to like, oh, take my advice on how to bake a cake. Hell no. I am just like you on Pinterest. Mother <laughs> shit out of those women on there. That are pulling some like, I don't even know, like professional. They're like, mm, I don't do this for a living, just whatever. Mm -mm. No, I'm here just to show you, like, I ain't at it either, but I'm a sure as hell try. So for Grayson's birthday, we use this company all the time. We even did on uh, Jersey Shore. It's like Shore Inflatables um, Bounce Company. And I asked them if they'd be willing to. And when I booked it, we were still just um, I guess on a quarantine until May 1st. And we're not, obviously. Um, but they said they will still do it. And they're just gonna take um, precautions where like I paid ahead, so I don't actually have to see them. I gave like, um, you know, a roundabout, like, like where everything is in my backyard so they can just set up. They're coming early, they wear masks, they disinfect and they leave and then they come pick up. I'll probably just Venmo like a nice tip for everyone that worked. So it, it keeps um, the social distancing at play, but it also, to me is nice cause like I feel like I'm still utilizing a business that could probably use the, the work, um, business that I love. My kids love them, and hopefully I'll be able to like really ball out with them one time. You know, I don't know what this world is gonna be like. And Milani goes to me today. She's like, "Mommy, you know, are we still gonna be quarantined when my birthday comes?" And I said, "Honey, that's a that's a really good question because I don't know. Um, I never." knew, I never thought in my lifetime I'd ever see anything like this. So, you know, it's, it's pretty insane. How do you explain that to a five-year-old? Try and explain it. I don't like sugarcoating too much with her because I find it to be a disservice. So I try and be honest. I try and tell her that, you know, Chances of us, like as long as we're quarantined, we, we don't leave, we, 
we just keep our distance and blah, 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 we'll be okay. And well, we have to do it because people get sick. And, you know, we want to make sure that not a lot of people get sick, but whatever I can say. But she, she's smart. She gets it. Grayson's funny as hell. Grayson doesn't give a shit. He's like, where's the cake? Where's the bounce houses? I just want Groot and Hulk and Spider-Man there and Thanos and Captain America. He's like, friends, eh, I'll see him another day. But Milani, she's a very emotional girl. She, she knows what's going on and I give her a lot of credit for asking the questions that she does. I just dribbled all over me. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. It keeps, oh my God. Oh my God, it's getting bendy. Sweet Jesus. This is my son, this is my baby. He's my last child. He's my boy, he's my prince, he's everything to me, so. So like we should put like smash. It actually is a technically tripping. Okay. Making it rain. Slime. Okay, well, I'm gonna clean up the edges and then we're going to refrigerate this bad boy so we can uh, prepare for tomorrow.